What's going on, Hashtag Nation? Today we are going to go over E and B Drag. This is a preview of his ebook that's not out yet. This will be in a Seattle Seahawks playbook. Who doesn't have a Seattle Seahawks ebook coming out, by the way? Um, but this is um Trips Tight End, Trips Tight End Offset. His favorite play in there will be PA Frosters. Okay, this is cover one. He didn't show versus purple, he didn't show his paying customers. Do, he didn't run the versus per he did not run his versus purpose. He ran like stock like this. So I'm gonna run a stock like this for a second. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go purpose anyway. Give that. Okay, here you go like this, okay? He didn't do this at all. He just ran a trait that for paying customers. Like I will say it all. Okay, so what this requires most likely is a his offense that he's be running the ebook is um apprentice tight end. But right now he's useless. We're gonna put him on a delay fade. And he went to the double team, the <coughs> excuse me, the right side of the screen. Uh, whatever side that your tight end is on, and the trips tight end, he went to the double team that side. So you can get helped out. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put a Y button on a slant. We're gonna motion slant him across the field. And um, if you see this guy, I mean, let me take the ball. You can see how the play works first. Okay. So it was going like that. And you just cancel play action as it's height. And you just go throw it like that. Because that's a catch it. Because the purple can't get there. The man got the man that's guarding him because there's a switch. Because when you motion him across the field, he steps all the way out. Okay? So he he not better run with him. See, he's already he's already beat. This is the user. You see the user down here creeping. Don't throw it obviously because he's gonna jump with that. But guess what? This guy this guy's gonna smoke his head. You get a Tyreek Hill. Let me show you. Let me just throw it. You get like a Tyreek Hill and Mutt. Um, that's a touchdown every time. Or Red, you put your fastest guy there. It's a touchdown every time. Okay. Same setup again. Okay. This guy creeps down anywhere down here. You notice the cornerback is like by the 50 yard line, the cornerback on the right side of the screen. So when I motion over Riga for that slant, he's gonna go to the outside, and that's how he gets beat. See, he steps to the outside like that, and then you go like that. But that guy's come down like this. Let's have a touchdown, okay? Every single time. So um, let me show you also this right here versus cover two as well. Same cover two, two men under like this. Most likely you're gonna guard this guy. They're gonna um use this guy. Sorry, guard this guy. Using him. Delay fade the tight end. The reason he wants to delay fade the tight end, well, not the reason. The reason he likes doing that is because of the um, if the user, if the the guard, the person that's that's assigned to that tight end blisses, and you notice that, or you the other routes took it away, you can send your tight end out, block and release, and um. Throw it to him. Throw it to him like three, four, five yards down the field because they, the user on blitz. They're not the user, sorry. It's in the user. The man that signs them most likely is on the blitz because they're thinking that he's blocking. Okay? That's like the that's like the last result route, okay? If there's two men under, when you split both safeties, you see him about to split safety, just throw it deep. Cancel the play action when the ball is high. Are you gonna play me though? Oh, that's Man, was that a three man rush? Respect. Let's try it again. Okay. Yeah, I'm using it. Let's go with it. Don't go through, you don't have to go through with the play, you don't have to go all the way through with the play action. I pick it up and then cover two. So two men under, you got him, okay? And most likely in cover two and cover two as well, let's say deep blue and deep blue, the, the middle safety, middle linebacker that's in the box. And he may get back there and pick it up, swat it down, whatever. Okay, that's about it with that with that play. Let's go over his second setup. This is a good setup as well. We're gonna put the tight end. On a post, in order for you to put him on a post, you have to have a princess on him, or you have to have a hot route master um quarterback. If it's the same like last year, we're gonna put the Y button, Y receiver. We got, we're gonna put him on an out route that should look like this. We're gonna put Goodwin on a slant. Oh, that yeah, put him on a slant like that. Okay. Um, 
Black the tight end. Again, he did this play too. He did not show it versus purples. So I'm just going to do it regular for a second. They do it versus purples. But what's going to happen here is when I motion Riga over, the, the cornerback that's on the right side, that's at the 50 yard line by himself, he's he's going to man switch. But I'm going to hike the ball when he gets to 13. When he gets to 13, when he gets the good one, I'm going to hike it. But that cornerback thinking he's coming across, but he's not. So they're going to man switch, and he's going to be wide open. Watch it. Watch this. See, he's wide open. So the cornerback got to come way across the field to guard him. So if you see somebody playing man coverage without the purples, this should work. You, you should get a, you most likely will get a touchdown. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it against purples as well though. Block it um because you wanna throw that quick you wanna throw that quick um out route. So block your um running back so that way he won't um you won't go through with the play action. Slant. Slant, out route, and um post. And this is with purples now, right? This is with purples. Yes, sir. Let's get it. See what happens. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, it's separation. You can pick up something, but you're not gonna be able to turn up the field like to win it. Just the um, when there's no purple. And if they just decide to go no purple or like this, you got like you have multiple people open. Okay, now the slant should get open. I think it's open. Slant is wide open. Do it mad late though. Okay, let me show you one more thing. How that um this PA crosses beat on oh, man. I didn't show you that. So we're gonna go back. We are gonna go with the original setup right now. Double team. Slant. All right. Um. This guy. What's his name? Who is that? Okay, Chris Harris have a Billy on him. What happened when I motion over the, the slant, Chris Harris gonna jump on go where this guy's at King is at. So Chris Harris have ability. Goodwin don't know he's faster, but Billy sometimes shut down faster. Guys, I'm gonna show you how to, that valve still gets open, okay? That's what that's what I'm gonna show you. This guy gets open and moves faster, right? Okay. I touched him, so I'm gonna just hike the ball. Hike it. So I touched him so that um he um he didn't move. He didn't go actually go guard up in front of him. I'm not I'm not gonna touch Harris this time. So you can see it. Okay. Now Harris jumps over him. He still should beat Harris going across the field. He know Harris have an ability and he don't. Okay. That's about it. This is a preview of his ebook. This is his favorite plays in there. So I don't know why he's making the ebook after this. This is his favorite two plays, but whatever. That's another story. That's another day. I'm out. Adios, I'm ghost.